What's going on YouTube? It is Greg Lock Fitness here. In today's video, it's time to cut. Look at salad arm. Salad arm. But yeah, cardio starting now. Not only is it going to decrease my body fat, my body fat percent is on about 5.1% at the moment. For body power, I would like to see it around 45 not a huge difference, but there will be visual differences, as you can see at the start of the video. I've started drinking coffee again. I don't know why. I started drinking a lot more coffee. So in here we had the gingerbread latte. In here we have got the hazelnut coffee. It's the filter coffee with the hazelnut, where you have to get the filter thing yourself. And, you know, with the gingerbread it's just a standard powder. But it's very, very nice. Put a lot of milk in. Whew. So you might think, what are you going to be doing in your cut? What are you going to be doing? What are you going to be doing in your cuts? So in my cut, I'm going to be doing more cardio. At the moment, I just do cardio to warm up. Or, to be fair, I'll increase my heart rate by doing a warm-up set of like 20, 30 reps on a light weight. So now I'm incorporate, incorporating... Incorporating... Mm, God knows. I'm including more cardio. So you might ask what cardio and what training methods I'll be using. Mostly I'll be using the treadmill... Actually, I'm going to be using the treadmill rower and cross trainer. They're the three things I'm going to be using. I don't really like to use the stepper and the bikes. I don't want to use the bikes as... The bikes are good for Tabata training, 20 seconds fast, 10 seconds slow. It is good as you can do that. And that is a fast way to burn body fat. But I will be looking more into the overall body where on the cross trainer you've got your arms, your back. Everything's included in it. Even your chest, your core, legs, everything. And also the same with the rower. Plus, I like to do 500 meter rows to try and see how fast I can do it, and 1,000 meter rows. So, you know, on my cardio days, I do want to do a different training method, and a different thing each time. And you might be wondering, am I still going to be doing resistance training? Am I still going to be doing? Am I still going to be doing? Am I still going to be doing the? Of course I'm going to be doing resistance training. So what we're going to be doing, we're going to be focusing on compound movements. So we've got overhead uh, standing shoulder press, we've got deadlift squats and bench press. Ooh. Yeah, so we've got those three exercises that we're going to be doing. We're also going to be focusing a lot more on our core. As I do want that better core stabilisation, not only to increase my abdominal muscles themselves, but I do want more core balance. It, I just feel it helps me a lot in such lifts as deadlifts where you need the tight core and squats as well. And overhead press and bench, so all four compounds that we're going to be smashing. So today, it is the second day of my cardio. Yesterday I started it. I did a five mile run, so it was outside. I didn't use any of the gym equipment. I just didn't feel like going in the gym yesterday, so I just went for a run for five miles as well. It, it felt nice to be honest. I don't know the exact time, but it was nice. Today I'm gonna opt for, hmm, let's just decide this now. I think I'm gonna go for the cross trainer and I'm going to work on 30 seconds fast, 30 seconds slow for oh, 10 minutes. That's gonna be hard. Considering my fitness levels are rubbish at the moment as I've been training extremely hard, trying to get put on size and mass. I've got to 12 stone eight. So that's the heaviest I've ever been in my life. I am happy, but we need to shred it down for body power. And next body power, you'll see my next body power. Not not talking about this one next week, but next one. I might be a completely different physique. You know, I might be one of these 14 stone brutes. But I doubt that because I haven't exactly got great body structure for building that. I have got the body structure to be aesthetic, which is good in some ways, but for someone who wants to be massive it's not but then again i want to be aesthetic more than massive i like being strong as well but it's hard when you've got longer limbs to train strength i'm not saying it's impossible and that you look at, at strong men like terry hollands and world strongest man multiple times i believe um brian shaw who i've got a picture with might put that up on the screen might not you never know um they are obviously big like like they're probably a bit out there to me when i stood next to him he's like up there um 
I feel my bone structure is not amazing for being strong. Although I'm pulling at the moment on deadlift 170 kilograms and I'm weighing in at 12 stone 8. I'm not sure what that is in kilograms, 80 something, low 80s. So I am pretty happy with that and the strength is definitely getting there. But yeah, let's get the shredding for body power. And I'm at 207 subscribers now, so I'm extremely happy with that. I'm going to get a video up every single day until body power from now, explaining what I'm going to be doing my cardio. So today we've got 30 seconds fast, 30 seconds slow on the cross trainer. Um, I'll say working between 10 and 20 on the levels. Obviously, as the days go by, my fitness levels will increase. Um, and my diet is going to be a lot of high proteins. Obviously, you've got to cut back on your fats and carbs when you're cutting. So a lot of high protein to maintain the muscle. Casein protein I'm going to be getting from cottage cheese. So I have took everything into account and I'm sure I'll make this happen. I am one of those who does like to do cardio when cutting. I don't just like to change the diet as I believe cardio is great. And plus, I do want to increase my overall fitness levels. So I hope this has got everything out for you. What should I entitle this? I think it's a sort of vlog. Yeah, day one vlog. Or is it update? I don't know. Beginning of cutting, I'll call it or something. Yeah. But yeah, if anyone knows how to do an intro or an outro and wouldn't mind making one, bang, hit me up. Follow me on Instagram, Greg Lock Fitness, Twitter, Greg Lock Fitness, and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. It's been Greg Lock Fitness.